gives you advice, yeah, on how to live your life. And welcome back to my channel and if you're new then welcome to my channel. I'm Cammie. Today's video is going to be a like pregnancy line progression test video. I've taken a lot of text, text, a lot of tests. They're here on my little notebook on here. So I've taken, excuse me, I have taken some of the, um, the, the easy at home pregnancy test. I've taken some of the Walmart 88 cents pregnancy tests. I have taken some of the like CBS and what, oh, there's my cat. It's okay, move baby. I've taken some Walmart and CBS like early response tests and I've also taken first response tests. So I have a lot of tests to go over with you guys. Um, just comparing the lines and everything. Okay, so I have a lot of line tests to go over with you guys. So yeah, if you guys are new, I hope that you will consider subscribing. It is unreal that I am pregnant. I am so like over the moon excited about it and excited to have this new journey. So if you're new, please consider, <laughs> please consider subscribing to my channel and yeah, I don't want you guys to miss out on this new pregnancy journey. If you are new, I have a two year old son who's almost three currently. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and just go over these tests. I'm gonna flip the camera around just because I don't wanna hold it up. I would rather sit it on the desk and point. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Okay, so here's an overview of all of the tests that I took. Okay, so the first ones are these guys. Now these are the super cheap ones from Amazon. It came in a pack with my um, ovulation test. So as you can see, I have written the day that I took them, like 7 DPO, 10 DPO. So I didn't get a line on these. Well, I saw it on 10 and I thought it was crazy. Um, and then 11, it showed up a little darker, but I still felt like I was a crazy person. And then finally by day 13, it was like a good line for me to be like, okay, like these are not wrong. And then for the Walmart test, this is the 10 DPO. You can barely see the line at this point, um, but it is there. I can see it. I don't know if you guys can tell on the camera, but I saw like the light line. And then as you can see over here, they got darker on 11 DPO and then by 15 DPO it was pretty dark. And then if you come to these guys, I think these were like the Walgreens or no, these were the CVS ones. I think like the CVS early response ones, they did not have good reviews online, but there was a tiny line here, but it just, it wasn't much, and I just thought maybe the test malfunctioned, but this one definitely got more of a line. Sorry that it's like yellow and gross now. And then the first response are obviously the ones people trust. So I got a line on 11 DPO because these are the ones that are like early detection and like more reliable. And by 13 DPO, it was much darker, so that was a good sign. And then these are the ones that I took later on. So this is like 16, like 18 DPO. So this is just, I think like the Walmart brand, actually yeah, the Walmart brand um, early response tests. So those were dark. And as you can see with these, that's where you see like the most line progression. This was 20 DPO, so it was significantly darker than where it started, but I feel like those were the best for an actual line progression. So I'll just overview the tests again, all the different ones. And I hope you guys enjoyed me showing you guys my tests. I know I seem like a crazy person because I took a lot. But when you're trying, you're trying, and you just kind of want to make sure and see the lines get darker. See you guys in my next one. Bye!